In a previous example, we modeled the population growth of Frederick County from 2013 onward using the equation that's given, 241,409 times 1 plus 0 0.008 to the t. So the growth rate is 0.8%. Use a graphing calculator now to find when this model predicts that the population will reach 400,000 people. So we want to solve for the value of t when the population is 400,000. We could do this algebraically, but we're going to use the calculator in this example. So what we'll need to do is we'll need to graph this model. We'll use x instead of t, but we'll graph this equation, and then we'll graph a straight line at y equals 400,000, and we'll find the intersection using the calculator. On the calculator then, we need to go under y equals to plot both equations. So first we'll type in 241,409 times, in parentheses, 1 plus 0 0.008, or of course we could just type 1.008, raised to the power of t, or in our case, x. Then we need to also plot y equals 400,000 on the same graph. And now if we graph this, we don't see anything yet because we're in the wrong window. So we need to scale this to the point where we can see what we're looking at. So for the window, let's use x from 0 to, say, 70. That'll take us forward 70 years. And let's go in steps of 5. And then for y, we need to go up to at least 400,000, because we know that's where we're looking for an intersection. So let's say 450,000, just to be safe. And let's go in steps of 50,000, just so we don't have too many marks on the y-axis. Now if we graph it, we can see that's the curve of our model. And then we should see a straight line next at 400,000. And you can see that intersection point pretty close to the 70 mark. So you might guess that the intersection is somewhere around 65 or between 60 and 65. But we can find this more precisely if we look under the calc menu, hit second trace, and the intersect option is number five. And since there's only one intersection, we don't have to worry too much about moving this close to the intersection point to begin with, but we will anyway, just to be consistent. We'll get close to it and then hit enter three times. And we find the intersection is when x equals 63.37 or about 63.4. So after about 63.4 years, the population will reach 400,000. That's what our model predicts. So that's about the year 2076, according to our model.